one step closer to the playground. Right now, some Polk County parents are sitting down with the school superintendent trying to convince her to bring back daily recess to elementary schools. It's a story that Eight on Your Side's Holly Bounds has been working on for weeks now. She joins us live outside of Highlands Grove Elementary in Lakeland. Hi, Holly. Hello, good evening to you, Stacy. This is just what Amanda Lipham hoped for. The chance to speak before the people who can bring back recess for more than three minutes tonight. And she says that she thinks that 20 minutes of play is vital for young minds. I'm very optimistic about it. Amanda Lipham likes where this is going. First came her petition, which more than 2,500 people signed. Next, she shared her mission in three minutes before the Polk County School Board. Her words were enough to spur the school superintendent to host an hour's worth of discussion Tuesday about implementing daily recess in elementary schools. It's a move she believes shows the decision makers take her argument seriously. And I think it's, you know, they're going to implement some uh, steps to have recess in every uh, grade level for um, every child, kindergarten through fifth grade. So. Now dubbed the recess lady around town, Lipham's efforts have already resolved the issue that got this fight started. Her kindergarten son, who was only getting free play once a week, is now burning energy like never before. He is getting out every day, but I'm still fighting for the ones who don't get that chance. And her fight isn't alone. Once she started, dozens of parents, teachers, and grandparents like Sharon McKelvey joined in. I, you know, could not believe how can they not have recess for kids? Their brains aren't wired to sit, you know, for that long and pay attention and behave. While her hopes are high, kids across the county will soon run and play every day. Lidham knows there's a chance it could take some time. If for some reason, you know, the right changes aren't made, we're going to keep fighting. Uh, you know, I know the public's still behind us and, you know, it's just we're going to let them know that it's unacceptable. You know, they need 20 minutes a day every day. Now, there is no vote set on this topic yet, but Lib Ham is hopeful that tonight's meeting could lead to that. Stacy? Now, you said it's not an issue for Lib Ham's son anymore. Why is that? Well, she thinks with all the noise she's made that somehow her school found a way to fit it into the schedule, but she said she's not giving up. Her fight is not just about her son. It is about all children in Polk County. All right. Interesting stuff. Holly Bounds live in Lakeland tonight. Thank you.